Hello, I'm Richard Frisbee. Welcome to a preview of the third concert of Socrates Pro Musica's 25th season here on Lighthouse TV 23. On March 21st at 3 p.m. and at 8 p.m., we're featuring the violin and piano duo of Rolf Schult and James Wynn. Mr. Schult, who is referred to by the New Yorker magazine as one of the most distinguished violinists of our day, and that's a big deal. In the early years of Sarmides Pro Musica, he studied under and performed with Dr. Herman Ash, one of the founders of Sarmides Pro Musica. To celebrate our 25th season, we invited Rolf Schultz to come back, perform on our stage, and tell us what it was like knowing and working with Herman Ash at the time. I mean, musicianship, friendship, things like that. We thought that would be a nice reference to our roots as we plan for the next 25 years. He will be joined on stage by James Wynn, the pianist and composition professor at the University of Nevada since 1997. He has a list of accolades too long to even recount here, but our website, www.sagratispromusica.org, and our Facebook page will have bios and photos and a complete program. The pair of them will be playing Schumann's Fantastica, Opus 73, Brahms' Sonata, Opus 100, and Beethoven's Sonata, Opus 47, better known as, known as the Kreutzer. To whet our appetites for this classical presentation, Rolf graciously sent a short clip, both of himself playing the violin and reminiscing a bit about Dr. Ash telling us about the concert that's coming up. Before we get to that, I want to remind you that Socrates Pro Musica is a 501c3 not-for-profit organization, and we welcome your support as we welcome your attendance at our upcoming concert, March 21st at 3 and 8 p.m. Now, let's hear it from Rolf, and thank you for coming. Bye. Beethoven, of course, had his 250th anniversary last year, and Socrates Pro Musica is graciously 
saving uh, its season 2021 and um, maintaining the concert schedule. This will be the third on March 21st with my trusted pianist James Wynn. We're going to play Schumann Fantasistico Op. 73, originally for clarinet, the Brahms Sonata Op. 100 in A major with its Meistersinger overtones, and uh, the Kreutzer Sonata of Beethoven's the seminal work that is the cornerstone of the program, which should really be called the Bridge Tower Sonata because of Beethoven's friendship with the mulatto violinist George Bridge Tower, who must have been quite a virtuoso. I will talk about the piece at the time of the performance, the genesis of the piece. Um, so you'll have to wait to find out the details until then. The concert, of course, um, also commemorates my long friendship with Dr. Herman Ash, who I believe founded the series. Um, he was a doctor by trade, a wonderful human being, very warm, very knowledgeable, and in the truest sense, an amateur. Um, you know the term amateur derives from the word amare, which means to love. Um, and he loved music, knew it very well from Bach through Haydn, Mozart, Beethoven, Schumann, Brahms, Schubert. Um, we had many lovely discussions about music, um, some of them in German since he came from Berlin, I myself from Cologne. And uh, it's a wonderful memory um, that we're going to honor on March 21st with this lovely program. I hope you'll join us then. <laughs>